What's up everybody? I'm getting ready to head out to Canada Cup. It is October 26th at about 5.30 in the morning and um, heading up to Toronto and we are going to be in the Toronto Convention Center for all different types of games and everything. So looking forward to doing some commentary and competing a little bit. And I'm going to be heading back uh, sometime on Sunday to head back to work on Monday. So this is just the beginning part. We'll see ya. Bye. What's up everybody? So I am here now in Toronto, Canada. This is downtown Toronto. It took two flights to get here from Pittsburgh, from Pittsburgh to Washington, D.C., and then from D.C. to Toronto. I met my buddy, Brett, at uh, the airport, and we took one of the trains down to this um, inner city area of Toronto itself. And you can see it's really well done you know there's beautiful brand new apartment buildings here everything seems pretty renovated different types of art and on this side over here is the convention center where the gaming is going to be this building down here is a giant aquarium by ripley's believe it or not behind that aquarium is a um a marriott hotel where a lot of the FGC room blocks are. And you can see there's all kinds of really cool stuff everywhere in this area in downtown Toronto. We'll see ya. Bye. What's up everybody? So I walked over to the convention center and um, I have my costume one underneath here. I took the horns off because I thought it'd be a little too much, but I ended up walking on the wrong side and down this hall right here, which is very pretty, um, it's a big art convention and uh, it's just really neat to see how the light comes through all these windows. You can see 
artists and all the different things that they hand make and hand craft. A couple of card games in the center here and different setups for casuals. We've got some classic games over here. And opening up into the general area. games here and over to this area they are having um, different demos for games that are coming out to try. Hey everybody, so when I got done doing the commentary for Ultra Street Fighter 4, I ended up staying around for a little bit and watching some of the Third Strike matches and some of the Soul Calibur matches, and my roommates wanted to go grab something to eat locally, so we went to one of the burger bars that's around here and got some fresh burgers, and I came back to the room because I'm going to change out of all of this. Hey, what's up everybody? So I'm back at the room and that's the uh, Marriott and I thought I would give a quick rundown of what the room looks like and everything for Canada Cup in Toronto. So you can see I'm in the bathroom right now and <clears throat> comes with a real nice shower. There's the mirror sink and this is the general bedroom itself got a nice tv and a desk two queen size beds shelving units a closet and right here is a little refrigerator and this is the view of everything. So pretty good, very nice room, very clean. Well, I am back from the second day of Canada Cup, and I got to play a little bit of Tekken. I got to commentate a little bit of Tekken, and I went out to eat with a couple of my friends to downtown Toronto's Chinatown district, and we got some amazing, authentic Korean food. So as of right now, I am back in the room trying to sort a couple of things out, 
and just thinking to myself the combination of having a convention center and a major tournament how the two work together and will this be something that Canada Cup will be interested in doing in the future there's a lot of people here that did not really know too much about the FGC that might be interested in joining in so we're going to see if these people are going to continue going to our tournaments or if possibly in the future we're going to branch off and do what we're used to doing which is tournaments by itself it's interesting to think about